Hey guys, Cody Afro here. I'm back from holiday. Yes, back doing some videos. I had a great holiday. It was uh, really nice. Three weeks in Croatia, Dubrovnik. It was really nice. I drove a bit as well, and it was it was I, it was a great holiday. Uh, great to see the family or whatever. And um, yeah, but I'm back making some videos. Uh, the videos I uploaded during uh, well, Game and Mike uploaded during the time I was away. They uh, you guys seem to like them, and also Game and Mike did a really, really, really good job at looking after the channel while I was away. Those of people have been messaging me and commenting to me saying he did a really good job, and he'll be still around doing some stuff if needed or whatever. But we also have the special announcement that we have to announce very soon actually and no one still no one has actually come close to guessing where it is i think there was one person that was kind of somewhere around the idea but nowhere close though i think you guys are gonna like it it's nice we've talked about it as well before on the stream so some of you who can remember back then or can maybe even find a vod of the stream that we were like chatting about it and then you might know what it is already but keep guessing, uh, it's not long now, maybe a week or two or whatever, and um, I, I'll probably announce it on a stream or and as well on a video to like release that. But anyway, Backward Seas of Motion 2. Carrying on this series, it's definitely my most popular series. Well, not well, right now, Train Sim is my most popular series, but this is my longest growing series. It's like on 35 or 36 episodes now it's a year and a bit old so it's definitely the longest and it's the, the series I started off with so I'm gonna you know carry it on it's kind of nostalgic in a way but loads of people have been asking me when is this next season motion 2 video when is it when is it please tell me is it gonna come up soon so here it is we're gonna continue it more on this Liverpool European cities campaign playthrough well, well I'm gonna continue it a bit uh, We'll, I, this this series will I'll kind of just make it more interactive. I like looking at. I have a here a piece of paper of like all the kind of comments of suggestions in the previous video. So we'll try and do that with these kind of uh, with cities in motion from now on. It'll be more of like that kind of interactive series. I'll take on board some of you guys' ideas and suggestions, and we'll just kind of build it up into a map. But games to look forward to, like in the September month coming up. Train Fever, this is, it's quite similar to Cities of Motion 2, but it's more like Transport Tycoonish. So that's coming out, which um, I'm definitely I've already pre-ordered it. So I expect a series of that to see. I want, I want to see your reaction of what you guys are you gonna guys like it? I don't know. We'll see. And then we have like other stuff like European Ship Simulator coming out at the end of this month, and also Trans Shipping uh, Shipping Company or something like that. It's like a really cool like shipping company sim simulator where you can like go to different harbors and ports. So those two games are gonna kind of bring me into the ship sim genre i'm going kind to of bring it out on this channel and see if you guys like that as well and also down the line world of subways volume 4 coming out gonna probably do some volume 2 and a bit of volume 3 more videos of those two before that comes out so you know there's those stuff anyway sim season motion 2 shout outs to the video go to the official universe of gaming and family history for beginners so that's again the official universe of gaming and family history for beginners there links and stuff will be down below all the shouts and stuff that were um, requested during the time I was away again my cousin on the list and he's going to give them to me to add to my ever-growing list so Anyway, we're back in Liverpool, and I think there's uh, quite a lot of stuff I need to tell you that I've done, like, after the last episode, I kind of did, I did more stuff. Uh, I added metros, as you can tell, there's green on the map. Loads of people, people were saying that I should add metros around the map and stuff like that, but I'll explain to you what I basically did. I'll kind of start down here in the centre here, well... Uh, here I kind of tried to make a central station, but well, it is kind of central station. It's kind of linking up these trams and whatever. It's pretty good. The metros are doing quite nicely. If I actually even have a look here, they're well, making quite a lot of profit, which is good. Uh, the only thing that isn't making me a profit, well, to be honest, the tr there's only one trolley bus line, and it's like a very small, very non-frequent one. So even that's making good money, and even the buses are. So that's really good. But anyway. Uh, I have how many lines? Do I have only two metro lines for now. Uh, I built more track to make more. The first metro line is uh, this first one, which goes from the bottom down here, and it goes through the city. Then it comes up here, and then it goes all the way here into this city, 
and then continues, 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 and then it stops off here. And then the second line, which starts back here in this city here, there's a depot here, the, like a buffer point depot, comes back, it starts here, goes along, goes along, goes along, goes along, uh, stops here, then carries on to this other city up here, which is pretty cool. I'm thinking of doing... I definitely, I think I can do a few more lines. We'll see. I definitely want to use the S-Stock train, which is like the new in the DLC, but there's also, there's other stuff we can do. Like there's, uh, I've made, where have I made? Oh no, I've, uh, also what I've done with the metros as well, is I've, I've kind of, I've run trams on them as well. So this tram here, this is tram line six. It starts here and then it connects up onto the metro track and then it kind of comes, follows with the metro, but basically the, the tram goes on the, if I can find it, the tram goes on the outside line, the metro goes on the inside line, and the tram then stops off here and kind of joins tram line 2, and I think, oh, and it just quickly joins here on the theatre here, and then it continues down into a tunnel, and then it comes here. I can't remember where else it goes. Oh yeah, it goes all the way there. So it's quite a bit of a lengthy tram line. It's doing, I think it's doing well. It should be doing well. Yeah, 9,000 to 1,000. Yeah, it's, it's doing well. So that's basically what I've kind of added. I've kind of added that kind of train line. One train line from there that goes to here and then one train line from here that goes to there. I might possibly... I was thinking of making another line that probably goes up to here or something like that and then starts here as well so you know I don't know I'm kind of thinking about it there's also I built here a little bit of a tram intersection here that goes down here so I can probably make another tram that maybe goes from this city to this city and then even one I could do here which goes from this city to that city or even the other way around, we'll see. Because there's a lot of, like, see, a lot of tram kind of stuff here. It's pretty a lot. A lot. But, um, yeah, uh, let's just quickly edit some t price tickets because apparently my tickets are so, so low. We'll do that. Oh, wow. Quite a I had the flipping. I had actually a mod for this that actually did it. Um, that actually did it uh, automatically for me. You kind of set it at a color and it's makes maintains the color one color but i don't think i have that installed but we're just going to quickly update these tickets people love to be charged more more because everyone's getting a good job in the city i'm guessing you know i don't think that's true for liverpool in real life let's just add that a bit more that's fine oh my god come on. wow people are going to pay that much wow just adjust this more and then I'm gonna go through some of the requests and we can just like uh, uh, just go through that basically so I don't have to kind of think of new things to do I can just go through the requests and be like yeah okay we'll do that so let me just adjust keep it okay one more. yeah one of um well let me just finish this I'm just excited to tell like what some of these some of these requests are pretty good as well and some of them I've already done already okay that's fine. It's annoying when you have to just keep adjusting these ticket prices. It's it can get a bit like you know, time consuming. Time consuming. Okay, I think we're good for train. We're good for tickets. So, um, I've had quite a lot of requests. I've taken some of like the best ones and just had them on the list. And I might not do all of them. They're just kind of like things to look uh, to debate on a bit. I might. Uh, do a bit in this episode where I kind of make these tram lines here, but everything else is doing pretty well. The, the monorails are doing well. This monorail that I previously built in the other episode is doing very well. It's feeding quite a lot of people into the city here. Uh, even the buses are doing well themselves. I might edit them a bit. But if we look at some of these on my little paper here, okay, um, let's. Uh, Master Phillips said you should build the monorails to each other, then build them like in a central interchange station. We'll kind of do that. I don't want to do that straight away. It is going to be a little pricey. I kind of invested uh, in loans to build the metro, which the metro is giving me back the money that I've kind of, you know, 
Oh my god, like I have to still keep editing these prizes because they're too flipping low. Anyway, let's just finish that up. Let's just quickly have a look at... Uh, so yeah, the Metro's, are, they're making the most money, so they're bringing back my money really well. So we're not going to do that Master Phillips in this episode, maybe in the future one or whatever. Felix Train said, great video. Uh, one suggestion, notice that the, the theatre area at the end of Tram 2 was getting busy. Maybe have one bus route that travels alongside the city. That's actually a good idea. If I just put my piece of paper down. Uh, yeah, around here we need some kind of little bit of buses, a little bit of bus activity because it's not really a hell of a lot going on around here. And even though it's not busy right now, it probably will get busy. So let's go ahead and you know build something. Um, if I hope I can do this, I hope I can put. Okay, good. That is good. I like that. So I can just I basically I put it so that uh, bus stop uh, buses can stop you. Oh, but. Oh, buses can't go on this tramway. Ah, uh, that, that fucked it up a little bit. <laughs> okay, well, what I'm thinking, I'm going to have a bus that kind of goes along this edge line here, and then we'll just work off having buses do other things. So, let's build a bus depot. We're going to need a big one, because I'm going to probably branch out some buses that go around this whole, like, area. So, let's build some stops. We're going to do the basic stops, because, you know, just to save money or whatever. So, let's get some bus stops uh, just going around here on this outer line. We'll build some other lines that go inside as well, but we'll just do one in this main road where there's, like, some in uh, some commercial industry and stuff like that here, and then some, like, you capture some of the houses and whatever. See here, like, we have a nice, like, cathedral, then we have a, like, nice shop here. Um, that would be also good to make a bus that goes through the middle here, but we'll do that a bit later. Keep going down here. We don't really need to stop around here. And then we could just have another one here. And then we'll have one here. We'll have one here. And then for a turnaround point, hmm interesting where we're gonna have this little, a little bit of a turnaround point let me first have a look if I can I'm gonna make the line and I'm gonna see if I can just if I can just um, uh, I'm gonna see if I can just go onto the tramways which I doubt I can they're only made for like trams and people so I doubt it but we can just have a try if it doesn't work we'll just have to make a make our own turnaround point Annoyingly, but you know. Oh, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop that. No, thank you. Well, add stop. There we go. No, there's no. Okay. So we're going to have to make our own bit of a turnaround point here. Okay. Um, let's build a stop here that stops here so people can get off and go get the tram, or whatever. And then. Uh, it would be good to just make one little bit of a slip road here, like a one, like just here, it turns in and then it just kind of, oh no, the space to build here, that's annoying. Um, oh, but that's annoying, okay, they can't turn, mm hmm. Oh, come on, that should be enough. Yes, good. Oh, but the stop's gonna get messed up. Okay, forget. It. We'll just we'll move. We'll move the stop. We'll move the stop a bit. There we go. And then we'll just move the stop here. And then it'll just have a turnaround. And then we'll just turn it around and go back the other way. Where are we going? So that's my kind of first little bus route. See, already people are waiting. This is going to be an a decent line. Just keep it going that way, that way, and bam. So I need some, I need some uh, bus uh, buses, and we have some loads of new buses because of the new DLCs that have been coming out. So that's good as well. We don't want these ones. We we need something a little bit smaller because it's like a smaller area I think because because I'm gonna have some a lot of vehicles branch out of this route I'm gonna have like I'm gonna have two primary primary brushes in this depot um, 
Is it really point? I don't want to put a bendy bus. It's annoying, but. Hmm. Actually, you know what? Let's go for it. Let's go for a bendy bus. Go for the Mori Sicarus. Let's get. Um, how much? We'll get. We'll buy 10. Because we're going to have to build some more lines anyway, so you know what? Buy 10 and just be happy with it. So, there we go. There's a little bit of bus line. We'll. Uh, in future episodes, or even in this episode, I might build another one that kind of goes through the middle and then stops somewhere and, go and goes back or whatever. It's just to build a line that kind of connects to these trams or whatever, which is kind of the idea. Also, I might build maybe another bus line that kind of goes down here. But also, I kind of edited the... Uh, the last time, I think, I edited uh, where the kind of cars go onto the interchange because there was a huge amount of traffic around here. And I just didn't want that interfering with my transport um, network. So I kind of just deleted a lot of roads that entered uh, uh, the, uh, the motorway highway system. So I just kind of thought it, it only pretty much, you can only get onto the highway here, but there's actually no roads that connect to here. So yeah, you, can, you can't actually get onto the highway. I kind of made it. Yeah, I kind of... Yeah, kind of block people getting to the highway. The only way you can get onto the highway is if you get off the highway and get on the highway again. But I just needed to sort out the traffic problem. There is now still a traffic problem that comes into here. But I'm not going to touch that yet because it's not really interfering with my transport network. So, um, already, oh wow, we can... I think we can increase the timetable thing of this a bit more. I know it's... Let's copy a timetable. What bus is kind of busy? Uh, what bus is busy? Let's do... No, let's just just do it ourselves manually. Let's do a every 110. It's pretty decent. Increase it to midnight. Uh, weekend, we'll do it to like 130 and increase it to like... 11.30, let's do that. Uh, night time, we'll have maybe every 1.45 and then increase that to, there we go. So, that should be good. Now, let's look what else we have. I don't want to redo much myself, I could edit some stuff myself. As I said, I want to build some tram lines there maybe in this episode. We should get onto that soon. Uh, what do we have here? Uh, okay, let's go up this list. Um, <clears throat> uh, Bas Rodegek, if I've said that right. Um, in one of the small cities, you have a tram line that uh, that you want to make a bus line to the industrial city. I would make that short tram line longer, connect it with the industrial city. Okay. Let's have a look where, where, where this is. Uh, I'm guessing this is this part, I'm guessing. And then the industrial city is here. So he's saying, what is he saying? He's saying, uh, you have a tram line and you want to make it a bus line to the industrial city. I would make that short tram line longer and connect it with the industrial city. So he's basically saying this tram line, I'm guessing this tram line that goes through the middle here, it's kind of the short tram line. Hmm. I already have this tram line here. Uh, hmm. I get what he means, but there's no real... Mm, I don't know, we'll s mm. I could, I guess, maybe make some tracks and just extend this tram line here into the city, into this industrial part. But I already have a bus doing it, and then I'm going to just make some more buses. I don't think it, it's necessary to make a tram line into there. I don't think. Maybe. No, I don't know. I don't think that I, I personally don't want to extend this tram line into there. Here is definitely just good by with buses, and we'll just 
and we have a, tra a metro train there so to, to connect into that city so to be honest I think the buses can handle it so far we're gonna add a bit more buses maybe around here we might do maybe a tram line that goes around this little city and then goes into there but I don't want to really extend this one to there it's fine it's not a busy tram line what tram line is this tram line four it's making a good profit anyway, so I don't want to really touch it. But anyway, thank you for the suggestion. Might try something with that maybe later on. Uh, ben also, why not make boats to connect other places on uh, other places that are in the map? Yes, boats is something we could look into. I could try and fiddle around with that. Actually, this um, this city, this part, this side, I'm leaving to last. Like basically, I'm making building up this area, and then even that area over there is kind of like getting built up. But yeah, we could. I think we could do something with boats. Maybe make some kind of boat thing here to here. But then that kind of defeats the point of the metro, if you know what I mean. Hmm. I don't know. I do not know, because boats are expensive. Don't get me wrong, boats are really, really expensive. The only kind of thing I could think of is maybe making a boat from this uh, this city here and kind of just connecting up. Just have like one, I would only make pretty much one boat line. I wouldn't want to make too many. I'll make just one that kind of connects maybe everything up. That could be something good. Hmm. Or, what I'm actually thinking right now is I could have one boat line that starts from here, kind of starts here, stops here, and then stops here, and then have another boat line that starts from here, stops somewhere here, goes here, and then goes round to here. So you can have like, you know, both, oh, but I don't want to have both, no, they'll probably start from here, both of them. Like the big area, yeah. I think that'd be good. Yeah. Okay, let's go for that. So let's, let's do something with the uh, with making boats. We have enough money. I've have. I don't even know how many loans I have taken out or oh, taken out a lot. But it doesn't really matter. These type of games, you just gotta keep taking loans and out. <laughs> anyway, uh, let's let's uh, build. Uh, where are we gonna put this water depot? Actually, we'll. Okay, we'll put one. Let me see how I'm going to do this. Yeah, we'll put one here. Uh, put one here. We'll just put one at the end stops, basically. That's what I'm, what I'm thinking. We'll put one here. There's no point of connecting. What is this? It's just like a little city area here, but... There I have it with the metro. Imagine if I put a boat that goes around into here. But they didn't even, the river doesn't even carry on. It would be cool to make like a little river line, but it's no point. Anyway, uh, let's then do some stops. I'm going to have one main one here, obviously. I'm going to have one main one here. And then we're going to have to soon start. We could probably just make some kind of bus line or something like here. here this just really needs a bus some buses that go through here just do uh, some like a make a small depot with some small buses that just carry people around that city and then eventually we'll extend some bus lines that go up into here or even a trolley bus line to save some money uh then i could yeah add one here this would be the one around here one there. I could even add one around here, but I think I could add that event, uh, like, in the future. Basically, when I add some more routes in this city here, this little suburb area, some buses around here, then I'll add that stop. But for now, we're just going to keep it here where there's already some stuff. And then we're going to connect to here. Oh, God. Uh, don't think it can catch... You can catch the bus, but I don't think you can catch the the metro. Or can it? Oh, oh yeah, it just about yeah, it just about gets the metro, which is good. And then, where's the main station gonna be here? Could even have two, you know, or one. Would it be better to have one or two? 
I think two would be better, just so that it doesn't get too congested. There we go. One here and one here. There we go. And they're like some on the city, right? Yeah, they'll pop up here or whatever. But yeah, those are the two. One will be the one for the line going back that way. And then we'll have one going along here and stopping here. I think here would be good. Come on. We can. There we go. One there. And I don't know if I could. Nah, there's no point. It's, it's just one here. I don't want it to. Well, again, we can add more stops in the future. And then it'll take its sh uh, short journey, all, well, long journey, all the way around here. Does that connect with that? No, it doesn't. Oof. Oh, wow. Well. There we go. Doesn't matter. We'll have to add some more stuff. But that this is basically what I'm doing right now. Is like I'm, I'm kind of building a... I'm building a kind of base structure for the uh, water bus network. I'm kind of building the kind of bare bones of it. So now it's only a few stops. Eventually, we can even add more lines or whatever, but, you know, that that's what I'm kind of trying to get at right now. So, let's... We're going to need waypoints. That's one thing you're going to have to... You're going you're gonna to need. Because... Water buses have... Um, they have issues when they're traveling. That's all I'm going to say. That should be fine. Then from here, here we'll just do it to there, and that should be fine. Then from there we'll do it to here. If that's about straight, yeah, that's straight. And then to down here, and I think that should be fine. Um. Let's build a line. What is that? Not enough depths. Yeah, we need to go around and check some of the vehicles and stuff like that. Bam and bam, and then it goes back here, back here, back the way it came. And I'm not going to do too much. There's not going to be a lot of people traveling out, so I'm just not going to buy too many vehicles. What shall we get? Uh, Stingray is nice. Stingray City Jet. Uh, hmm. I'm probably going to say I'm gonna get obviously something small I don't want to get something too big I'll probably get the stingray Peter for this line so how many wait this line has one two three four stops that line has one two three stops hmm okay I will buy hmm I think I'll buy two for this line one for those, and then when I build this other line, uh, where does it start from? That stops. Uh, one to here. There's no available route. Oh, please don't tell me it's. Maybe I need to add a way waypoint. I think. There we go. Let's see if I add. There we go. Yeah, I just needed a waypoint there. There we go. Add that. Add that. Add that. Add that. Add that. Add that. 
And then for this one, we're going to speed. What's the speed here? Acceleration. All of these ones are excellent. We'll do these ones. Two. We'll buy two stingrays of this. Two like that. There we go. And there we go. Those are two water bus lines done and dusted. Let's hope they do something. I guess they will. Yeah, this one, this one I wanted to just get a little bit of a smaller one, but... Oh, I could have... Oh, I could have just done it, did it to here. This is the thing with waypoints, and when you when you do it from afar, you think, yeah, and then when you look close, you'll be like, oh, that's a lot of wasted time it's doing. Might have did that in the future, but for now, I'm, I'm cool with it. But so far, good. This line's getting some stuff, and these two will get... I'm glad I actually built two instead of share, uh, both lines sharing one, because it can get a little bit congested. But even though there's only there's only two, uh, it's only two two um, two boats working on each line, so it's nothing too big of a problem. But anyway, those are the two lines for the water buses. So we now pretty much have every kind of transport kind of thing. Right, uh, we need. Uh, there was some problems with uh, tram depots, I do believe. Ah, oh, it's this one, isn't it? And what trams do we have on this? Just have a look. Trailcad, okay, is it, it's probably some congestion problems, but we'll get some more, buy four for them, um, yeah, okay, that's good, anything else needs more trams, I don't think so, everything's looking spicy, that one's doing well as well, yeah, uh, what else do I have on this list? I think I want to leave some for the next episode. Let me have a look. Uh, hmm. I think I'll do one more of these requests. Um, this is from Ruben van Meer Groot. Groot, however you say it. He said, yeah, hey, nice video. Um, bus line 5 could be a perfect tram line. It won't be a direct money bank maker, but it will make some money. Tram line 4 could be expanded to the industrial area. This can make you a huge tram line with a possible connection to the city tram line. Yeah, people talking again about that tram line. Which one is bus line 5? That's like five. That could bus line five could be a tram. Um, am I reading this right? Bus line five could be a perfect tram. This could be that one could be a perfect tram line. Why? It's it's not really like a busy area to have a tram go along this way. I think the bus is doing fine. Let's have a look at what's it doing. Oh wait. Oh no, I'm looking at the- oh, snap, there we go, sorry, I, I just dis deactivated it by accident. No, but that is bus line 5, no, bus line 5 is fine, yeah, it's making money, it's good, it's it's not overcrowded, it's doing its job well, no, I'm, I'm happy with this bus line 5, I don't want to change it into a tram, but again, it's saying that tram line 4, where's tram line 4? Could be extended to the. Okay, let's let's do this extension. I know you guys want me to do it, so let's just do it. Cause I'm sick and tired of people just like you know. Hey, let's do the extension. Okay, we'll do the extension then. We'll have to basically now. Uh, let me have a look how I'm gonna do this. Trams, no roads. We need this. We're gonna do a path like this, and we're gonna extend it. I'm gonna extend it to this road, I think. Yeah, there we go. Are you happy now? Uh, look, even buildings and stuff are gonna pop up like crazy as well because the sea growth is. So I can even build some tram stops along there. And then. Yeah, can I upgrade these roads a bit? Can I upgrade them? No, I can't. I wish there was a, a feature where you can actually upgrade the roads. That, that's like something which is, you know, a little annoying that you can't do. But, you know. I actually might... Hmm. I have an idea what I'm going to do. Okay, so let's get some tracks. What am I doing this? Tracks. Tram tracks. Okay. There we 
go. And, oh, we need to extend it into there. There we go. Uh, we're gonna take it this way. Take it this way. Take it that way. Take it that way. Take it that way. Take it that way. And then from here, we're gonna use a single track. And that's good. There we go. So that's the extension there. And we have loads of houses there, so we're going to have to put some stuff. But now, if we add some more tram stops, we're going to have to obviously add some tram stops here. Because loads of things have been built here now. Which is good. It's good. Saying it's bad, and then we just add some stuff around here. Continue around, stop here for, and I think that's about it. So now, now I basically have to go into the route. Is it tram line four? Deactivate the route. Uh, look at the bus stop list. Cancel that, and then add and then go this way and then come back around back into the depot so I'm hope I'm happy you got um, I hope you guys are happy the people that have asked for this route to be extended into the industrial area there you go there's your industrial there there it's done so now if I activate it and I need to probably lower these things now because it's going to be crazy you're going to going to need much more trams added weekend we'll lower it to about 130 is about good we'll increase it to 11 that's good night time we'll do it every 135 and then increase that around there we go how many uh, vehicles needed? Eight. And how many is right now? Five. Let's just in. Well, let's just buy the. Fr uh, how many. Wait, which vehicles run on this one? Which vehicles run on this one? I can't even remember which ones run on it. Vehicle list. Is that a vehicle list? Yeah, it is a vehicle list. Vehicle list. Ah, it uses the rail calculator. Okay, rail calculator will buy three more for you. There we go. And that is hopefully done. There's the extension for who was it that it said uh, Ruben van Meer Groet and also uh, was it Bas Rodeck? Yeah, Bas Rodeck. But anyway, um. I think I'll end it here guys for this episode. I'll definitely do more. There's definitely a lot more to do and stuff like it here. Look, we're having so much congestion and stuff like that. We might improve that a bit maybe. Or we'll see. But definitely they, uh, in the upcoming episodes make some more tram lines around here. Because I've obviously laid down the infrastructure for it. Extend it to here whatever. And then even to here. The... Uh, I think the ferries are going to be do they're doing fine. <laughs> they are actually pretty much doing this see uh, well they're both making a profit so that's that's good that's good to see so yeah they're yeah they're doing well I might add a few more vehicles but I think two is fine like even though people are waiting let's be realistic in real life do you get like ten ferries coming for people no it's only like two or three even three is a lot two you have two that shuffle and do like a, a one way or whatever so that's what I mean like you know, it's a bit more realistic. But anyway, yep, Liverpool's going well. Uh, great to do some more cities in motion. Uh, we've done quite a lot. Oh, even this bus line's doing pretty well. So that's good. See the Icarus, whatever it's called. Yep, it's doing well. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Keep like commenting and stuff like on these kind of videos, Sims Sim 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 Motion videos, because I want to make it more interactive where I get you guys involved in helping me build like this uh, infrastructure, transport infrastructure network. But I hope you guys enjoy it. Remember more video, uh, more games and stuff like Train Fever to come, which is interesting. It's like kind of like this game where you build your own train network, but it's more like Transport Tycoon ish. While this is more like you just 
building like, train lines or whatever there's no real like benefit or whatever like while in train fever like transport tycoon you get to uh you know do industry uh, transport goods and stuff so i can't wait for that more games as well in september and other stuff like that it's great to be back i hope you guys don't, uh i hope you see it as a motion to fans who've been begging me for an episode here it is more will come because i want to you know get through this campaign it's, it's quite a long campaign i don't know what you actually have to do i think it's this I think maybe once this is done, maybe it's over, but I don't know. We'll see how it is. We may have some of these objectives, objectives to do in the next episode. So, you know, great to be back. Uh, again, shout outs for this video go to the official universe of gaming and family history for beginners. Their stuff, links and stuff like that will be down below. Give them some love. Again, if you haven't, if you'd like to subscribe, keep up to date with my videos I post. So just subscribe, it's free. It will always be free. <laughs> Don't think it will ever be paid. But um, yeah, like the video if you like the video. And uh, if you have any other people that are interested in the series of motion too, give it a share. I've been Craig Effort. I'll see you next time. Bye bye. We ain't never given up because we ain't born for that. Gotta catch a fast to do. Fast to do. The ship is cruising its cruise.